Get on your big boy boots and head out to the Everglades Alligator Farm. This is where you can spend the day on the stomping grounds of more than 2,000 gators. Hi, my name is Debbie Tivis and welcome to Everglades Alligator Farm. We have airboat rides, alligator show, snake shows, alligator feedings, a nature trail where you can see alligators nesting. So come on in and check it out. Welcome to Everglades Alligator Farm. My name is Bob and I'm going to talk to you about alligators and crocodiles. In my right hand, I have your American crocodile and endangered species. In my left hand, your American alligator. They estimate over two million alligators in the state of Florida in the wild. We have alligators on a farm being farmed just like cattle for meat and leather. And we have an alligator hunt once a year. They estimate the number somewhere around 2,000 for your crocodiles and they are an endangered species protected by law, very few in number. Florida is the only place in the world that has both alligators and crocodiles native to it. Well, a lot of people think they're slimy. And they're not slimy, they're actually very dry and soft. So once they come up here and pet the snake, they're like, oh, okay, well, it's not that bad. And yeah, they'll, they'll get a little comfortable with the snake. <laughs> <laughs> At the end of each show, we basically let the audience hold both the alligators and the snake so that they can, you know, get a chance to take pictures and, and, uh, Get to hold the snake. My name is Andy Burns from Tallahassee. We're down visiting. Finally got a chance to visit Florida on a vacation. So uh, even though we live in Florida. My favorite part of the show was probably whenever he threw the piece of grain and his mouth and his jaw just snapped. It was pretty scary. <laughs> There's everything from alligators to, uh, to the Everglades. So it's fantastic. When you're out in the airboat, you actually will be in the river of grass. That's what the Everglades is known as, and uh, you'll be actually gliding in very shallow water, sometimes six to ten inches of water at a time. And you'll see the Everglades close up and personal. You actually see the, the very shallow water and also the cattails that are up. And as they're heading out, they also do some really wild spins. So you get a little wet, but it's a lot of fun. You'll end the day with a lunch date, except the food's not for you, and your lunch companion is a gator. The experts feed the gators before it's time to say bye, y'all. Now as they go under the water looking for the food, they do not swallow under the water. They'll find the food and then bring it back up above the surface of the water and throw the food to the back of the throat. Now you see them with their mouth open, they have 80 teeth in the mouth, 40 on top, 40 on the bottom. These teeth are hollow. They break off a tooth, there's another tooth right inside that ready to replace it. In their lifespan, they'll go through approximately 3,000 teeth. Life expectancy somewhere is around 60 years in the wild. And in captivity, it's not uncommon to have an alligator over 100 years. Now remember I said they swing their head left or right, and that's because directly in front of their nose is actually a blind area. They cannot see directly in front of their nose. Everglades Alligator Farm has got a great location. We have the Everglades National Park main entrance just 10 miles down the road. We are also 10 miles away from Biscayne National Park as well. So we lie between two national parks. We're about 45 minutes from downtown Miami and we're about 45 minutes from Key Largo, Florida as well. So we are centrally located. So come on out to Everglades Alligator Farm. You'll have a great time and a great day.